Dr. Osborne, please. The performance enhancers aren't ready. The data just doesn't justify this test. Now, I'm asking you for the last time. We can't do this. Don't be a coward. Risks are part of laboratory science. L let me reschedule with a proper medical staff and a volunteer. I mean, if you just give me two weeks. Two weeks? In two weeks, we'll have lost the contractor quest and Oscorp will be dead. Sometimes, you gotta do things yourself. Get me the promochloroparazine. For what? It begins catalyzation when the vapor hits the bloodstream. 40,000 years of evolution and we barely even tapped the vastness of human potential. Thanks. No problem. Hey, you have blue eyes. I, I didn't notice without your glasses. You just get contacts? <laughs> well, see ya. Funny, don't you freak? Yeah, it was just an accident. My 
practice breaking your teeth, that's the accident. Come on, Flash. Stop. I don't want to fight you, Flash. I wouldn't want to fight me neither. Kick his ass, man. <laughs> Yours, man. Jesus, Parker, you are a freak. Peter, that was, that was amazing. My wife Rosie and I would like to welcome you this afternoon. But first, before we start, has anybody lost a large roll of $20 bills in a rubber band? Because we found the rubber band. <laughs> It's a terrible joke, but thank you for coming. Today, you will witness the birth of a new fusion-based energy source. Safe, renewable energy, and cheap electricity for everyone. And now let me introduce my assistants. These four actuators were developed and programmed for the sole purpose of creating successful fusion. They are impervious to heat and magnetism.
These smart arms are controlled by my brain through a neural link. Nanowires feed directly into my cerebellum, allowing me to use these arms to control fusion reaction in an environment no human hand could enter. Doctor, if the artificial intelligence in the arms is as advanced as you suggest, uh, couldn't that make you vulnerable to them? How right you are. Which is why I developed this inhibitor chip to protect my higher brain function. It means I maintain control of these arms, instead of them controlling me. And now on to the main event. Give me the blue light, Rosie. Precious tritium is the fuel that makes this project go. There's only 25 pounds of it on the whole planet. I'd like to thank Harry Osborne and Oscorp Industries for providing it. Happy to pay the bills, Otto. Ladies and gentlemen, fasten your seatbelts. We have a successful fusion reaction. This is a breakthrough beyond your father's dreams. Thank you. We're producing a thousand megawatt surplus. The power of the sun in the palm of my hand. He had more than a drop of tritium. He could have destroyed the city. I'm ruined. I have nothing left except Spider-Man. You saved your life, sir. He humiliated me by touching me. Strauss boy, the press will be here soon. I suggest we move on. What was he doing here anyway?
As you can see, molten metal penetrated the spinal cavity and fused the vertebra at multiple points, including the lamina and the roof of the spinal column. We won't know the extent of the damage until we get in there, so I suggest we cut off these mechanical arms, slice up the harness, and if need be, consider a laminectomy with posterior spinal fusion from C7-T1 to T12. We're ready, doctor. Anybody here take shop class? <laughs> We got a little fluctuation on one. There's a change in the silicon mass. Yeah, it's probably a bird. It'll fly away when we fire it up. Initiating demolecularization.
How is he? He's got to be okay. But there's been some memory impairment, particularly short-term memory. Right now, he can't remember the accident or anything that happened to him recently. Is it permanent? It could be. Only time will tell. He's awake if you want to see him. Oh, oh maybe I should wait. Ah, oh, it's fine. Just keep it brief. I want him to rest. Hey, buddy. Hey. Hit my head. Yeah. Doctor said I was in an accident. Hit and run. I don't remember much of anything. My father. He died, right? This is all so weird. Hi. I got here as fast as I could. I know that face. How you doing? I don't know. Last thing I remember, I was fine. Somewhere. You're still fine. We love you, Harry. It feels like... somehow I've been gone for a really long time. And now I'm back home. It's good to have you back. I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to ask you guys to scoot, okay? Okay. All right, thank you. Well, I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah, great. Get some sleep. I think he's gonna be fine. I think so. And you guys seem great. Yeah. You have lovely friends. My best friends. Give my life for them.
Emma, it's Kurt. Is he there? I'm afraid not, Doctor. The car's taking him to the Veterans Hospital in Brooklyn. No, 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 he can't, Emma. You, 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 you have to stop him. He... I would, uh. but I always lose him when he's on the bridge. I'll make sure Dr. <sighs> Rother returns your call as soon as possible. <laughs> I'm gonna hold an avenue across the river. I'm in a hurry. Okay, you want me to take the shuttle or the bridge? Bridge! Okay. Take the bridge. Alright, we're gonna do that. Oh. Hey man, you alright back there? Are you tweaking me? Just drive. Okay. So sorry, I kept you guys up. I'm insensitive. I'm irresponsible. I'm hungry. Drinking? This is. I don't think so. This is your meatloaf. This beats all other meatloafs. Something is very wrong. Yeah. Nobody likes you, me. Okay. He took the frozen macaroni and cheese. I noticed that. Why didn't you tell me you didn't like my meatloaf? Um, you could have said that to me 37 years ago. How many meatloafs have I made for you?
We have to move now. Why? What's happened? I know it's hard to admit, but how spectacular a move is this? Am I right? Right as rain. Okay, so, fairy godmother, it is time to grant me a wish. I want in to special. How dare you come back in here? You recalcitrant, unworthy, defective urch freak. Sorry, that's just not the answer we were looking for. Clear. Welcome back to the bonus round. <gasps> Let's take a walk, shall we? The grid is all yours. work. We ran every diagnostic test, apart from human trials. Oh, I've actually already run human trials. You're just too stupid to know it. Do it. Now. Uh-huh. I got your medicine though. Oops, sick. I can't get to my 
worth it for the farm I've put together for this company. Design the grid, they're making it. I know. Williams just but you didn't know it was my birthday, huh? Did you carry? Think you could sing happy birthday for me? I'll just have to sing it for myself. Gilbert! What? It's Max. Can we shut down uh, power on sector uh, 32, please? Forget it. I'm out the door. What do you mean, though? Listen, I'm up here. It's dangerous. Sorry, right, Max. Hello? Fine. I'll do it myself. Dancing is perfect. It's crazy. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday, dear. Happy birthday to me. kid, I used to draw cowboys and Indians. Um, actually, it's Native American, but... Yeah, I'll tell you what, though. Not that bad, is it? No, yeah. Kid's got a future. Yeah, well... We'll see, I guess. You can't saw through that stuff. These alien bastards are tough. You gotta use the stuff they use. See? All right. All right. Oh, hey! Glad you could join us. Afternoon. Yeah, my alarm didn't go off. Yeah, 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 your alarm. Look, just go stack that armor plating like I asked you. This is a huge deal for us. Attention, please. In accordance with Executive Order 396B, all post-battle cleanup operations are now under our jurisdiction. Thank you for your service. We'll take it from here. Who the hell are you? Qualified personnel. Look, I have a city contract to salvage all this, okay, with the city. So I apologize, Mr. Toombs, but all salvage operations are now under our jurisdiction. Please turn over any and all exotic materials that you've collected, or you will be prosecuted. Ma'am, what am I? Oh, please. Come here. Don't read it. Come on. Look. I bought trucks for this job. I brought in a whole new crew. These guys have a family. I have a family. I'm all in on this. I could lose my house. I'm sorry, sir. There's nothing I can do. Maybe next time, don't overstand yourself. What'd you say? Yeah. He's right. I overextended myself. Uh, 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 uh. Put him down. If you have a grievance, you may take it up with my superiors. Your superiors? Who the hell are they? The joint venture between Stark Industries and the federal government, the Department of Damage Control, will oversee the collection and storage of alien and other exotic materials. So not assholes who made this mess are getting paid to clean it up? Yeah, it's all rigged. Experts estimate there are over 1,500 tons of exotic materials scattered throughout the tri-state area. Hey, Chief. We still have another load from yesterday. We're supposed to turn this in, right? I ain't hauling it. It's too bad. We could have made some pretty cool stuff from all that alien junk. I'll tell you what. Let's keep it. The world's changing. It's time we change, too.
go, Mason. <laughs> Business is good. 